Hi, good morning everyone. This is Karen Corcoran Hall from Tara Biscandado and ClientMarketingSolutions.com. I'm here. Good morning, Tara. We're doing a little bit of movement of furniture around in the office this morning. Um, I hope you can hear me well. Um, I just wanted to do, without all the scraping and, and pulling across the floor that Tara's doing, let me have a seat. Um, I wanted to have a little bit of fun this morning um, with my English Union Jack flip-flop and the, my little coin, which is the last uh, emission of the Peseda, the last Peseda that was actually brought out before the Euro came in. And uh, I wanted just to, I think the following has got to be said, an image speaks uh, louder than a thousand words. And I think that it's positive imagery is really, really, really important. So, hi Helen, good morning. How's the, I saw that you've been uh, in work in your new job for a year now, so congratulations on that. Lovely to see you. So anyway, let's get to the, the nitty gritty here and have a little bit of fun with this. What do you think a flip-flop, okay, and a coin can do to change your life in a positive way? All right. What do I mean by this? I mean the following, that in life we have, when we feel bad, when we have an event or something or someone that uh, affects us in a negative way and we feel bad because our feelings are always our GPS, our feelings are always our indication of uh, you know what we should be doing. If we're feeling good, then, then we're in abundance. If we're feeling bad, we're, we're not having a good day. So our responsibility, our job is to get back to that feeling great again. So how do we do that? When you have a contrast, when you have something that, uh, an event, something that's made you feel bad, immediately stop it. How do you stop it? With a flip-flop. If you have that mental image of a flip-flop, okay, I'm using the flip-flop for two reasons, because I hit myself over the head with it. I've not gone down. This is mental imagery. You will not forget this, this, this session, I believe, believe you me. The flip-flop, you stop yourself immediately thinking that negative thing, because the more you dwell on something, the bigger it gets, okay? The typical thing, when something bad happens to you, what do you tend to do? You dwell on it in your own mind. You go over and over and over in your own mind. And the other thing that you tend to do is, you bitch, you moan, you groan, complain to someone else. So what are you actually doing here? You're spreading out your negativity rather than keeping the positivity. If you spread your positivity, that's great. But when we have something that annoys us, our tendency, our natural tendency is to share it out. All right. So stop doing that. Stop flip flop yourself. And if you have that mental imagery, stop yourself thinking in that bad way. Where does the coin come in? We have the coin has two faces. We can flip the coin around. If we have the negative side of the coin, the yin and the yang, if you want to think of it that way, we have the positive side. We have uh, the queen or the king or something on one side of the coin and the other, the, the head of the effigy of the king of, of Spain, Juan Carlos. So if we have a negative event, which is one side of the coin, we can decide to flip it round and we can see the contrast. In other words, Say something has happened that's really, really negative. Um, you've lost a client in your business. What is the positive? What would be the exact opposite, the contrast of that event? Getting a wonderful new client walking in the door or phoning you up or connecting with you and signing a wonderful new client up, even better than the one you've lost. So that's what you've got to do. Flip the idea around that negative and change it into a positive. Why? Because you don't have to worry necessarily about what you have to mechanically do to get what you want. You have to make sure that you know what you want, okay? So it's ask and it's given. You ask for that new client. You focus on that rather than the fact that you've lost a, a client because that sometimes happens. Um, and you move forward. So the flip-flop, stop your negative thinking. And the coin has two sides, the positive and the negative of every event you have the contrast. If you have something good that, that you have something bad that happens to you, you know instinctively you can flip that round and you know what what is good. Okay. So I hope that is um, helpful. I mean, I certainly want it to, to be something that um, would be a, a, a big mental image because you're not going to forget me um, on a Friday morning, hit myself on the head with a flip flop. 
I promise I haven't flipped. I just flip flopped. Sorry for that. Anyway, we're getting back to the, 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 the serious side of this. This is a great idea. If you mentally think about something today, put it into practice because a good idea only remains a good idea if we don't implement it. So what do you do, honeys? You literally, today, something bad happens to you. You could have something right now that's nagging you, that's niggling you, that's worrying you. Think of what the thing is and immediately stop yourself thinking about that, but flip it around and think in the actual opposite. What would you need to make you feel good at this point in time? And attract that. Focus on that. Think on that. And that's the how. Sorry for that. That, that was one of my positive alarms. Um, the flip-flop flip -flop and the coin can actually change your life. It can positively change your life. So, I mean, you can actually take this one step further um, and actually carry the coin around. You may not want to put your flip-flop in your handbag, um, but certainly if you have a coin or get yourself one of these tiny little keyring flip-flops and it will be something that when you actively stop yourself thinking and then it will become such of a habit that once impossible now easy it will become something that's you know second nature to you and this will change your life you will start to positively attract loads and loads and loads of more things great wonderful things the things that you want and you deserve in your life so i hope this has been positive if it has share the flip flop and the coin um you can go come back to it obviously and listen to it again this will also be going um, in a few days onto my new YouTube channel. Um, so that be Tarabiz and um, Tarabiz Condado and Client Marketing Solutions on YouTube. Uh, so you can share it out and see um, how we can actually, with a flip flop, even if it's just a mental image of a flip flop and a coin, change the world to something much more positive and much more loving. So. I hope you have a wonderful day, guys. God bless. Have a fabulous weekend and uh, we'll speak soon. Take care. Bye.